What is up ladies and gentlemen, Scott here today bringing you a speculation video about the underwater features of Fallout 4. Now, we held off on doing this video for a while because there wasn't a whole lot to say, but recently Bethesda uploaded the special video all about endurance, indicating that there will be an endurance perk that will improve your swimming capabilities, described as I've added confidence in the swimming pool. This perk shows the Vault Boy submerge himself underwater, suggesting that this perk probably determines the amount of breath you have when swimming underwater. Maybe it even helps you swim faster. Who knows, but it's very interesting and the fact that there is a whole perk dedicated to swimming could would indicate that it will be a significant feature of the game. Look at this picture hidden away in the concept art from E3. It looks like an underwater first person view of a Myalurk queen, and if you look at the edges of the art, you can see it looks like we're wearing some kind of helmet or visor, like a breathing mask maybe. This practically confirms underwater gameplay, but do bear in mind it's just concept art, though the swimming perk is pointing to the idea that there will be a good amount of underwater exploration. If we look at the rest of the concept art, we can see that there are many scenes of boats washed ashore or piled up on one another. We also see scenery that looks like it's been previously flooded, like this quarry here. There are even images of the city that look like good portions of it are flooded. Maybe floods are even part of the dynamic weather system. And check out this image here, which looks like there is a boat off in the distance that the character is looking out to, like he's about to go and explore it. There's also this mutated octopus creepy ass thing, which could be an underwater creature that you see and have to avoid because it's gonna eat you for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. All of these pieces of evidence points to a lot of swimming and underwater exploration. Perhaps we'll even be diving underwater to get items from underwater caverns, sunken ships, flooded quarries, or even an underwater vault that has been submerged due to flooding. It's interesting to think about, but one thing is for certain, swimming will actually be useful in some aspect because there is a whole perk dedicated to it. Want to hear a fun fact about Fallout and water before I go? Every single major Fallout game involves the idea of water in the main storyline in one way or another. In the first Fallout game, the water chip of your vault broke and you had to go find a new one. In the second Fallout game, you had to retrieve the Gek to save your town Arroyo from drought. Fallout 3, you had to activate Project Purity so you could purify all the water, and in Fallout New Vegas you had to help a faction gain control of Hoover Dam. Just a fun fact for you Fallout fans. Anyways, you guys tell me what you think of all this underwater goodness. Share your thoughts below, share this video with your friends, get their thoughts, and most of all, like the video if you are excited for some underwater exploration. Thanks for watching and subscribe for an immense amount of Fallout 4 content that will be coming out from us upon its release. See you next time.